Hi guys, welcome back. Oh, yes. Yes. Episode 110 of Building with B Double O, I think. Welcome back, welcome back. Shut up, scape. Ooh, you are more aggressive. You really want in on this. Come on. Have, woo, jeez, yo. Okay, you had a plan. We're just having a simple, yes. Ooh, inching closer to each other, slowly embracing one another in a in a gracious embrace. I say, "Hello, how are you? You are fine." It's very strange. Hi, the interaction that these people are having with me right now. It's it's one of those moments. I remember, um, boy, back when I was in college, I had a girlfriend. And, um, she, they had a dog, and I believe it was an Irish wolfhound, I believe that was the name of the dog, it was humongous, it was huge, it was the size of a horse, and their house was a little smaller, unfortunately, the, uh, the dog ended up making the house just smell terrible, um, but... I was kind to the dog. I was kind to it. I, I showed it love when it when it had no love to shown to it. Um, but there was this one moment where this dog and I, the dog was laying on the kitchen floor, and being the young, wild college student that I was, I decided to lay on the kitchen floor with the dog. <clears throat> Let's get some bone mail. So I'm laying on the floor with the dog, and I'm looking at it, <clears throat> and it goes, now this is before I ever had a dog of my own, but the dog looks at me and goes, <sighs> so, and it kept doing that. I mean, just laying there, calm, collected, but giving the old <sighs> noise, and I was like, Hold on, let me stop this story for one second so I'll explain. I'm rounding this mountain out a little bit, if you haven't noticed. I'm rounding this out. This used to be a sheer cliffside. I'm kind of tapering it as much as possible. Um, I'm going to get some smooth stone as well because kind of our project for today is to clean this disastrous area up a bit. Um, okay, back to the story. So I'm laying there on the kitchen floor with the dog. And it makes that noise, that <laughs> blows out, blow out noise, you know? And um, I was like, this is very strange. It was almost like the dog was trying to talk to me. And so then, oh, I thought a villager was in here. I heard that door close. It's just closing automatically. Um, so then I did it. I was like, And then the dog did it immediately after, right back to me. And then it did it again. I went, and it And we went back and forth. Granted, I'm a college student, very easily amused. But this dog, for the next, I would say, two to three minutes, responded to me with its noises over and over and over again and I was like what is going on it was one of those moments where it's like I'm actually we are on a very elementary level communicating together it was really really weird crazy communication get up there communication With an animal. Now that I had, and I mean now, I, I mean I've had my own dog, and I have learned. I mean after after getting my own dog, I was like, holy crap, man! Like I used to. Um, I mean he stays at my parents now because I spend so much time here on YouTube that I, it's almost neglectful for me to to own a dog because. 
I'm just here. But I can have a wife! <laughs> oh, <laughs> but, um, anyway, I got too much stone, that's for sure. Um, so we're remaking this sheer cliffside again, but with an intention, okay? And you'll see what. Hopefully this is going to work out nicely. Um, hmm. But I, uh, either way, once I got my own dog, I was like, holy cow, like, he, he lives at my parents now. But um, there were moments where I was like, this dog is talking, it's speaking the English language nearly. Like, I could say, do you want to go to grandma and grandpa's house? And that dog, it loved going to my parents' house. Um, and I'm telling you, it would absolutely freak out. Just like, yes! It knew what that was. I could say any other set of words in that tone, and that dog knew those trigger words. Poof, that would do it. It's like, yes, I will and I do want to go to grandma and grandpa's house. Loved that dog, loved that dog. Okay. Boom, boom. That's good. Let's get some stuff going on here. More dirt, please. Thank ya. Great. That's good. That's kind of sheer, isn't it? A little too sheer. Build up. I know y'all. Scared to death. It's dangerous, I know. I live the dangerous life. It's a little too sheer still. That'll fix it. Great. Great, 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 great. Great. That's better. It's better than it was. Good. Okay. Now, this situation. Um, ooh, who? Do not let go to shift in that position. I would have died. Who? Um, so, but yeah, I guess I, I told that story to tell you that, uh, I was just having one of those moments with the villager where it felt like I was communicating with it. Okay. So, today is Monday. I am recording this Monday, and, um, this is the day you'll be seeing it, and today... I've got my work cut out for me, no question on that. I have got so much to do. Okay, this is not bad. This is not bad. That's a little better looking. It's not a big disastrous mess. It does look like it's just cut out, <coughs> but it kind of, although I could join this. Ooh. Hold up. Is this the right thing to do? It's a ravine, you know? It's a ravine. But maybe joining it here and adding some supports similar to those except better. Let's give it a shot. Let's grab a bunch of dirt. Let's try. Let's sleep as well. So zombies aren't breaking all our doors, making us waste wood. It's a good idea. Um, but yes, today is the recording day of massiveness. Yesterday was supposed to be one of those days. Did get some stuff recorded, not as much as I want. Um, I fear I'm not going to do it. I know I talked about this a little bit in the Minecraft episode that I feel like I might not be able, it's a little bit of a daunting task to be able to get done what I need to get done. Some people were like, oh, that's easy, that's so cake. I could have done that, blah, blah, blah. No, you couldn't. <laughs> no, you couldn't. Um, I mean, those of you that have been following us for a while, I'm sure you've heard many of the guys talk about how long it takes to record one episode and render it and upload it. Uh, sometimes it can be a four hour process very easily um, so yeah granted 
since I have, and I have to, my main time crunch, the main thing that I'm going to be pushing for is the fact that I have got, um, tomorrow, I've got to head out to Chicago. Going to be heading over to Jenny B's place. Going to be um, joining him for the Cocktail Tuesday. So for those of you that are looking forward to Cocktail Tuesday, you will be able to catch it at generic twitch.tv slash generic B. Of course, I won't be streaming it um, because I will be away. I will be away at his house. <laughs> so it will be live, on site, on location. We will be streaming together. And it should be a total blast. We should, should be a lot of good fun. So make sure you tune in for that because I think some great things are going to happen. Uh, most likely. Um, let's see. How do we want to do this? Uh, let's actually elongate this. Uh -huh. Maybe. I know this is crazy. What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Pull it all together. Dubs. Pull it together. I think this is going to do it. This is some serious terraforming stuff here. Randomness. I need to hire Doc M. Help me. Help me, Doc. He's good at this stuff. Uh, let's keep this at a level two right here. And then bring it out a little bit. Down. Oh, without the grass on it, it'll be hard to tell. Yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad. That's not bad. Little man-made. We'll have to do some adjusting and editing to this. Boom. And this, we're going to need some randomness. A little block there. one there there just random get it random that's helping for sure that block is just here to keep well villagers were running off of here but now now they are dead and they shall never return okay that's better that looks pretty good pretty good and then ooh ideas. Alright, well, I'm going to get at this after a quick commercial break. Alright, check this out. Check this out. So, here's what we're going to do. Boom. 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 There. Shouldn't I do that? They will join. It'll be fine. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Vines, baby. Some vines on it. If you like it, why don't you be able to put some vines on it? Put some vines on it. That's the song. Beyonce knows. Okay, that's better. Now. Now, now, now. Um, boop doo. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Got it. Yes, like a boss. Sweet. Okay, so. Fence posts, not strong enough to support that. No way, shape, form. No way. I want that grass to grow on it. I want to smother this thing in grass. Everything looking a little better, I think. That I want to take down. With my sword. That Those blocks right there. Keep an eye on them. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That creeper's still down there. Hey, yeah. That's good. Yeah, that's good. Just like that. Just like that. 
Maybe even that. That's just resting on that dirt. That's stupid. I'll have to fix that another time. Ha <laughs> ha! Got it. Gorgeous. Okay, very cool. So I definitely want all this grass to grow across here. No question. Um, oh, Seth. <laughs> Seth is lucky. Seth just hit me up on Skype. Seth Bling. Um, <laughs> he's talking about getting prepped for Minecon and whatnot. Now, he's got a lot of stuff. Apparently, he's running some pretty major things out there. The the uh, the uh, Minecraft boys really like them some Seth Bling. So, he's going to be running quite a few... What are they called? Things, whatever they are. <sighs> um, opening ceremonies, he's doing something. And, but um, as far as his YouTube prep for Minecon, it's so easy. <laughs> like he just hit me up saying he wanted to do some TF2, which I would love to do right now. But hoof, I am, I am biting at the bit, baby. Biting at the bit. What is it? What am I biting at? I am chomping at the bit. That's what I'm chomping. To get things done. Where Seth, he can release a video a day or a video a week. and yeah, He'd be perfectly fine. Get a million views on it. <laughs> okay. So, a little neglected area. But I think, I think we're going with a pretty smooth flow of where things are. Um, where they're going to be, how things are growing here. I like it. And I think adding stone under every dirt block. I hear them bones rattling. Don't act like you don't think I know you there. <laughs> but yeah, stone under dirt. This helps a lot, I imagine. Feels like it does. It makes more Minecraft sense. I thought, I just realized this the other day, and I was like, wait a second. Wait a tootin' pickin' second. You know, dirt is one meter. One meter in, in this game. So, three, we have about, usually, let's go to an area over here. Uh, that looks pretty flattened out. Let's, uh, let's just, just test it. One, two, one, two, and this should be stone. Three, four, five. Oh, hmm. Interesting. So, 15 meters? No. Yeah, 15 meters. Well, you know what? I guess that does make sense. Maybe you would hit stone once you dig down that deep. I don't know. It just seemed strange to me that that all was happening. Tree, right here. It needs to happen, doesn't it? Can we terraform this a little better? I think we can. Hi, stop. I think we can terraform this a little better. I might leave that as is for the moment. Boom. Yeah, that's a better flow. Put some flow with it. Put some flow with it. Okay, tree, here. Great spot for one. And it's going to be big. It's going to be beautiful. It's going to be massive. Right? Mm, 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 mm. So, for those of you that are going to be at MyCon, holy cow, I can't wait to see you. I can't wait to meet you. Um, this is going to be quite a time. Quite a time we're going to have together. Really looking forward to meeting uh, viewers, friends. Uh, if you do view this series, my videos on a regular basis, I consider you my friend. So, really anxious to meet you and uh, shake hands, hang out, and uh, just overall have a good time. Three, four, five. That should do her. All right. For real? There it goes. Ah! Oh, it's so beautiful. Yes, that is a gorgeous tree. Yes. I'm sorry. I love me some trees, baby. That is a just a glorious 
Masterpiece of a tree. Wow. Wow. This is going to be your video screenshot. Nope, it needs to be daytime. It needs to be daytime when I take this picture. Yes, it do. And I feel like I'm hopefully... Excuse me, pardon me. You punched me before, you know. You punched me right in the face. Yes, you did. <laughs> oh, crap. Um, Hold on for me for one second. Hi, yay, yay, cult. <laughs> All right, be right back. Okay, welcome back. Sorry. Sorry about that. Oh, okay, so, yes, this is kind of... That glass blew up, which I need to replace at some point in time. Um, so, I'm cool with that. I think that that's looking nice. It's definitely helping this area. Those vines are growing real nice. Now, I wanted to do... Hmm. <laughs> Let's see what we can do. We've got blocks in place. Let's see what we can do. This lines up with right here. So, I'd like to be in front of it. So maybe... <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Okay, I feel you. I can just go sideways, whatever. Um. No, man. Where'd it go? Got it. Okay, great. Dirt me. There we go. I will fall off of this thing before it's all over. That is for sure. Oh man, I just realized I was recording 60 frames a second. Enjoy! <laughs> it doesn't make a difference for you guys. Um... But as far as I'm concerned, it's taking up a lot of hard drive space, and the render is going to take forever, and that kind of blows. <laughs> oh, that's okay. All right. We said we do it all for the ladies. The ladies. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Let's take this up without one goes up. Oh, shizzle. My nizzle. Bam. Very good couple of cool looking posts there all right and then and then that that very good and for now this and I've got two stairs left thought we were gonna need to use more but since we don't have to Okay. You know, I'm pretty good at using the number keys. Um, it's not bad. I would like to see this wrap, kind of. But if I did, it would really, it would really seem pretty massive. So maybe just a little something, a little detail. Fences, great. I got them. Mm-hmm. Now, I want to just, this is not done. This is just putting blocks down to see what we're dealing with. See what we're looking like. That's not bad. That is not bad. That gives us a feel of a little bit of an entrance. Yeah, a little bit of a support there. Uh, it's not really holding anything up on that side. Well, let's make it. Let's make it hold stuff up. Shall we? Oh, we shall. Okay. Get on. I want that one there. Yes. Get it, baby! Alright. <laughs> I'm gonna get so hungry from jumping so much. Jeez. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Maybe. I don't know. Where does it stop? 
I don't think it should come out that far. To be honest. Let's take a look, though. Let's take a look, see if that's right. It's not terrible. It's actually pretty nice. Pretty nice indeed. And then, we've got the ability to do this. Bring this baby down. hi yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. Yes. Cool. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Grass be growing like a champ. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Alright, so that could be something. It really could be something one day. It's growing up! This is not looking half bad. These don't look right. So, stone? That? Take care of that? Please? And that spot needs one. But that's not terrible. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, I'm feeling that a little bit. I'm feeling that. Pretty good. Pretty good. I'm happy. We'll have to do a little more work on this. With what you can do with stairs now, there's a lot, a lot of cool stuff that we can do. But then next we'll want to clean this inside up and uh it doesn't really have to be anything just yet you know i wanted it to be shops where villagers would kind of hang out and do things and they kind of did um just not like i wanted them to i i really my mind wants the villagers to be a lot different than they are um they just don't act like I like them to. They just kind of derp around. I don't know. It's hard to get them to spread out a, a good ways, and um, so I don't know. I had originally envisioned that villagers would would treat these as houses, and so there would be kind of like a. These would be the ravine villagers, you know? All those lights are hooked up to the day-night sensor, so they turn on at nighttime. And I thought it would be cool, but eh, didn't work out like a plan. But that's okay. Um, so next episode, guys, next episode, what we're going to do, I think we will kind of stick around this area a little bit. I will probably mess around off camera. We'll have to... The reason why this is this progression is happening is because we just made this. We just fixed this problem, thanks to a loyal, beautiful, wonderful subscriber. And um, so, next step is to work out, you know, the other side of the mountain, in my opinion, and then, um, which we've kind of done, kind of. I'll fiddle around with it some more, but I think it's not bad. And then we work our way in here. So, I think we'll kind of hang out around this place. It might be good. It might be good. And then we'll get this shop put together. Um, but anyway, guys, I want to thank you for watching. Thank you again for all your support. Looking forward to meeting you if you're going to be at Minecon. Look forward to seeing some vlogs from me. I've got some... Um, I'm definitely going to be doing some, some live video out there. Um, the quality, unfortunately, is not going to be what I wanted. I wanted to get a better lens for my camera. Um, but that turned out to be an expense that uh, the wife, she wasn't really ready for that. <laughs> so, um, might just be iPhone quality stuff, but maybe better than nothing, huh? Yeah, I mean, hopefully you guys will enjoy it. So, um, anyway, look forward to seeing you guys. Look forward to meeting you. Thank you again for all your support. Those of you that uh, aren't going to be there, I am going to be here. I am going to be here. I'm going to have videos waiting for you. So anyway, thanks for watching, guys. And we will see you in the next episode.